Hello there, welcome back to Neetha's Indulgences. Let's keep it easy and tasty today. If you have guests coming over and you need a quick snack, these dishes are simple and ready in no time. So, what are we waiting for? Let's crack on with it. Our first dish is ramen rice paper rolls. This is a crispy, cheesy and a fun snack to make. So I'm using bulldog ramen. You can use any ramen of your choice, but I want to give it like a Korean touch. So I'm going to open this. Oops, add some water. Let's add the noodles now. Add the seasonings what we have here. Okay. So as per Vignesh, this is supposed to be very spicy, so I'm not gonna throw in the full sauce. Right, Vignesh? Mmm, looks delicious. Delicious. Okay, this is rice paper roll. You get it in all the shops. I'm going to dip this in water. Once the paper is soft, we're going to add in our filling. Ooh la la. Add the ramen into the rice paper roll. Add in your carrots, some cucumber. Sausages. Let's add some cheese. Mmm, yummy. I'm going to fold the rice paper now. Fold it tightly. Let's try the rice paper roll. I'm using sesame oil. You can use olive oil for this. Dun, dun, dun. You can add a little bit of sesame seeds, but I don't have sesame seeds, so I'm using in a little bit of spring onion. Time to turn this around. Ramen spring rolls have turned light golden in color. Time to take out now. Sprinkle some spring onions. Our second dish is rice paper noodles. Rice paper noodles are made by cutting them into thin strips and mixing them in a simple sauce. Let's dip the rice paper into water for a minute or less than a minute. Oh oh, jani jana. Let's cut them into thin strips. Okay, this is the only complicated part. You might get it wrong. After a lot of hard work, our rice paper noodles are ready. Now, time to make our sauce. Add chopped garlic, some spring onions, dark soy sauce and light soy sauce together, red chilli flakes, add some vinegar, Add some oil. I'm using sesame oil. If you don't like the flavor of sesame oil, you can add olive oil. So our sesame oil is getting heated up. Add in your rice paper noodles. Now if your rice paper noodles are stuck, add in some water and then just drop it into the sauce. Give it a good stir. Add some more chili, red chili flakes if you like spice. Let's keep two boiled eggs along with it. Just look at that. Delicious. 
I have kept two boiled eggs cut into half. This is completely optional. Now you can add some chili crisp oil. Lovely. The tasty rice paper noodles are ready. Let's try the rice paper noodles now. Mmm, nice and spicy and very flavorful. Let me try the ramen rice paper roll. Mmm, mmm, so delicious. My cameraman is just salivating looking at it. Thanks for watching today's episode. Today I made ramen rice paper rolls and rice paper noodles. If you are new to rice paper, it's a thin and edible sheet used for Asian cuisines to wrap up some tasty filling. So this is made basically from rice. Try out these recipes and do let me know in the comments below. Until next time, take care. Bye bye. So what are we waiting for? It's better for my baby. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> ah, oh.